Welcome to meditation. My name is Olivia Kisper and I'm so happy that you are here. I am very excited about this meditation. And I also want to really thank to Christine who left a comment yesterday or a couple of days ago saying that she shares my meditations with her friends. And then in the morning they text her and say thank you Christine for sharing because they really enjoy them. And I want to thank all of you who share my videos, who like them and comment because it really, really means a lot to me and this way we can really help other people to drop down into what really matters and my meditations are really designed to discover something for yourself be creating a space for you where anxiety is not forgotten and put all the way down only so it can bite you later from the back we're really gonna deal with it we're really gonna deal with some anxious thoughts today so we can really really arrive into more understanding and compassion about ourselves and, and we find that space within us which is already relaxed and peaceful so arrive into where you are and I'm going to start with a gentle reminder that none of your circumstances create your emotions. Your emotions are created by what you make it mean about those circumstances. And we are so quick to make it mean something about us. We make everything mean personal. For example, he didn't look at me, it means he doesn't care about me, or I had some trauma in my life, that means that I will never be okay, or I don't know, my, my, one of my boob is smaller than the other one, that means I will never get a boyfriend. Whatever it is, today this is an invitation for you to notice these tendencies we have. And see your mind really as a spectrum. On one side, there is the knowing mind, it's the ego, it's the mind that knows. Oh, that's a beautiful sound that's coming up from the candle that's dripping on the floor. And as the candle drips on the floor, your body is relaxing even deeper and deeper. And so, on one side, your mind knows everything and it wants to be right about everything. On the other side, you have the I don't know mind. It's the mind, in other words, it's the loving mind. And this is where we are going to go today. And first, I really want to invite you to Feel your body and soften inside of your body. Perhaps you didn't even notice or you haven't noticed that you have some tensions. It's just become aware. How is your body really feel today? Mm-hmm. Okay, find a position where you can be completely still, whether it's sitting up or lying down, where you can be completely still and relaxed, just relax, whole body. So I also hope that you enjoy the sounds of the rain, and as the rain dope raindrops are falling down it means nothing and you may notice that there might be some thoughts from the day coming into your awareness are you listening to my voice and 
it means nothing. Just notice those thoughts without labeling them bad or they shouldn't be there. Just invite them, get curious. Perhaps there is a thought about who said something. So just notice that it means nothing. And you may expand your hearing to all these sounds around you. Perhaps in your room. Just really start noticing all these sounds. And focus on my voice at the same time. Just notice that even the sounds mean nothing. And perhaps in your mind's eye you remember looking at yourself today in the mirror and maybe remembering some judgments about you. So just notice but it means nothing. And as you are relaxing even deeper and deeper, there might be some thoughts and stories reminding you or just arriving with its presence trying to remind you of what happened. Perhaps it's about someone who is close to you or important to you. Maybe they did something or said something or they should have done something. They shouldn't have done something. Just notice, just notice, without trying to change what your thoughts are telling you and just know deep inside that it means nothing, it means nothing about you, it simply means nothing until you make it mean anything about you. And this is an invitation for you to really notice what is it like to really observe your mind and observe your thoughts and your life and all the people that really doesn't mean anything. There is just curiosity, expansion. Notice that every time you label a situation or a person as bad in some way, Immediately we create this separation. Suddenly we are separate from them. And it's this gap. It's the gap that invites pain to enter into your life. So just notice. And come back to you. To this moment to just observing your mind, your emotions, the stories, the dreams, 
that are the stories, dreams about the past and dreams about the future that we sometimes call memories. See if you can simply witness those as just an unfolding, simple unfolding and if there is any thought or a story that's asking for its attention by coming back again in this softness and stillness perhaps you can open even more to welcome this thought and really see it for what it is it's nothing it's not even real it's made of love it doesn't have any substance no, your whole life is like a dream it's like a comet that disappears even when you look at your life 10 years ago all those situations now look like a dream that happened a long time ago and yet when you were experiencing those situations it felt very personal now you can really see it for what it is so settle into your own being into your own witnessing training your mind to really meet all these thoughts and people that live in your thoughts with understanding and compassion not with anxiety and stress relax even deeper soften even deeper your body and the more your body is relaxing there is a space opening up inside of you so just welcome that space and see if there is no thoughts or stories coming into your awareness and without labeling them as good or bad whatever happened just see it as nothing just for this moment I am not inviting you to tolerate a painful situation or ignore what needs to be done I am simply inviting you to investigate for yourself and to truly see how quick your mind is to make something mean about you how quick it is to mean that you will be stuck somehow in the future in a painful situation and even though this is not even happening you're already feeling some anxious sensations so come back here come back to your body this moment this moment is what truly matters 
and your internal life is always way more important than anything outside of yourself if there was such a thing Because your entire life is simply a reflection of what you cannot see about you and there is nothing that you can ever do wrong everything is happening for you because how do you know that all of these people and circumstances that we label as bad and we judge them how do you know that they are not serving you in some way to really gain more understanding about yourself that will lead into your expansion understanding really coming back to your true nature how do you know that any of that will lead to a better outcome in the future? So stop labeling and just come back here. Come back here to listen to my voice. Come back here to your breathing. Come back here to what truly matters. Because everything else is nothing. It's the mind that doesn't know. That's the loving mind. in constant state of curiosity and openness doesn't need to label because it knows it can't the ego likes labeling it loves labeling it does it automatically all the time and there is also nothing wrong with that just what it does and for you, it's just to notice and come back to what truly matters. And to notice that sometimes when we are so close to being at home, to be with what truly matters. The mind comes and again comes with a story and what ifs. The mind always thinks about what if and brings new images into our consciousness, into new thoughts. So just notice. Notice them for what they are because they are nothing just nothing come back knowing that any situation that you have in your life you have everything which you need to make the right choices in the space of wholeness and being centered and present not from a space of agitation just notice the mind wants to label what's good and what's bad 
just notice. It's nothing. It's a dream. What truly matters is who you are in each moment. Coming in the space of support, love, and inspiration. From the present moment. Knowing that you have access to deeper knowing in each moment, if you just take time to really notice, to slow down, especially when you really want to run, to slow down or stop and just notice what wants to reveal itself. Maybe there is something you haven't noticed. In your life, maybe you've been so anxious, there is something you really haven't noticed. Maybe there is someone who is really supporting you, or something just came to your life that's new, or something that's been there and you completely forgot to acknowledge it, or someone. So just notice, it's all happening for you and everything else is nothing. <laughs>